moving around some stuff on the stage. Let's give it up for Chris and Dana. I'm not going to try and explain them. <laughs> uh, I have, I've been a fan of My Brother, My Brother and Me for quite some time. And I, uh, for slightly less some time, for uh, the last two and a half years roughly, I have been their tour manager. Yeah. Which means I go around, uh, you know, city to city with them. I get them to and from the shows, I make sure the shows run fine, I make sure that they've got their highly specific uh, food and, and liquor requests. I have to, to stroke a lot of egos and a lot of backs of crying grown men. It's a whole thing. But, so I've been working for them for some time, and then once a year, for some reason, I pay them and their families to come take a free cruise. <laughs> and I continue to set up their stage and wander back to the wings and grab their highly specific liquor requests. <laughs> the fuck did I do with my life? <laughs> no, it is truly, truly hard seltzer. It's what we got. <laughs> oh. I did not butter up the can. <laughs> Though I was sorely tempted, there was always space between the can and my butt, which is a sentence you would be surprised to learn I have said before. <laughs> I would like to now bring out my favorite McElroy, Clinton McElroy. Okay, I want to prove a point to you that the gold team, those people, the ship was not rocking like this. <laughs> so you're going to get two times the show. Yeah. Not only that, but he totally rubbed his butt. <laughs> I'm just telling you. 